About 7.30 p.m., our patrol officers were dispatched to this location for a hit-and-run investigation. A noise is heard, then sirens. By the time fire and police arrive, the driver is gone, leaving the victims of the hit-and-run driver seriously injured or dying in the street. When officers arrived, they found the pedestrian in the street. Um, the pedestrian eventually did pass away. Many of the recent hit-and-runs in Orange County have a common theme. They happened at night. It looked like she kind of tried to push her baby out of the way, and it just demolished the whole stroller. The baby was thrown. You could tell uh, it was about 40 feet away from the actual impact. Police say sometimes the driver may not be at fault, but they may be unlicensed or drunk or scared. But the minute they run, it's a crime. It's, it's just unfortunate that it happened this way. Police advise that while walking at night, pedestrians should wear brighter clothes and take extra care when crossing a street, even in a crosswalk at a traffic signal. The baby was unresponsive. She wasn't moving at all. While the number of hit and runs has not increased, their consequences have. I don't understand why this person thinks that he's just going to be able to live his life and, and disregard what happened here.